These last 10 nights of Ramadan, they require jihad. They require huge effort and sacrifice. Why do I mention the word jihad specifically? Because Imam al-Bukhari, rahimahullah, pay attention to this. When he wrote the book, uh, or when he collected the ahadith of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam in a book he called Sahih al-Bukhari, when it came to the chapter of jihad, where he collected all the ahadith related to jihad fi sabilillah, one of the categories in this chapter, he, he called it babu al-jihad min al-iman, that jihad is from iman, it is from iman. And then he mentioned a hadith that proved this. One of the hadith he mentioned was the hadith of Laylatul Qadr and uh, يعني, uh, seeking Laylatul Qadr. So Ibn Hajar, rahimahullah, he said, uh, commenting on the wisdom, why did the Imam al-Bukhari put a hadith concerning Laylatul Qadr in the chapter of Jihad? Why? Shouldn't that hadith be in the chapter of Ramadan? Ibn Hajar, rahimahullah, he said, that look how smart Al-Bukhari was. He put this hadith in the chapter of Al-Jihad so that he can tell us that Laylat Al-Qadr requires jihad. It requires maximum effort. Give the last 10 nights all you got. We need jihad, my brothers and sisters in Islam, jihad in the worship of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Full effort, strive and struggle as much as you can. Wallah, Imam Malik rahimahullah when he was asked about, you know, a person leaning on the wall, leaning on the wall just to support himself because of how long he prays. And Imam Malik, rahimahullah, he said, I dislike this for the obligatory prayers and it is permissible in the voluntary prayers. Yani, yani, lean, lean on the wall if you have to, to find support for your long nights of salat. Wallahi, my brothers and sisters in Islam, it is only 10 nights. If you want to guarantee, if you want to guarantee the reward of Laylat al-Qadr, listen up, I'll give you, I'll give you a solution. Guaranteed that you will catch Laylat al-Qadr and earn its reward? Isn't this everyone's question? Listen to how brief the answer is. Make the most of all the last 10 nights and put maximum effort in all the last 10 nights. Guaranteed you will catch Laylat al-Qadr. And you will earn the complete reward of Laylatul Qadr. Allahu Akbar.